the following act of types of shirk that also takes the person outside the deen of Allah is to believe that the prophets or the awliya know the unseen or the future or anyone claims to know the future. Allah the Exalted says, and with him are the keys of the hidden matters. None knows them but him or but he. And he knows whatever there is in the earth or on the earth and in the sea. Not a leaf falls, but he knows it. And there is not a grain in the darkness of the earth, nor anything fresh or dry, but is written in a clear record. So this is a matter that a lot of people fall into, except those whom Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala saves. Where they take an attribute that is only given to Allah the Exalted, and they give it to the angels or the prophets. It's only attributed to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Like the known, as we said, of the unseen, knowledge of the unseen, knowledge of the future. Going to, for example, a soothsayer or a fortune teller, a Prophet ﷺ says, He who goes and asks him, has, his prayer will not be accepted for 40 days. And he who goes to a fortune teller and believes what he says, has disbelieved in what has been revealed upon Rasulullah ﷺ.